Hello guys, my name is Tim Demoni Andrew and I'm a data analyst for UBZ. So some couple of weeks back, I wrote a blog post for my company on custom shape map using Power BI, which I actually liked. But towards the end, I noticed that there were some particular features which I don't really like, which was the Power BI app. So I created a Power BI app for the blog post at the end. So if you click on this Power BI app, let me click on it. It opens another website for you. So when I clicked on the, on the link, it opened this Power BI app for me, right? But you notice directed me to another link, but which I don't really like. I want in such a way that the Power BI app will be embedded inside the blog post itself. So, okay, so I'm going to show you how to embed both Power BI apps on your WordPress and also Google videos on your WordPress. So, the first thing I need to do now is I need to go to my edits. I need to edit it. So, the first thing I need to do, I need to go to my edits. That's my WordPress admin, right? So, I'm going to install two plugins, which is iframe and embed so after you've installed both the iframe plugins and also the embed plugins next thing you need, you need to edit this post so I, i'm going to click on edit here right so i'm going to edit right so i scroll down scroll down to this place here so i'm going to open bring out my notepad that's notes that's my notepad so i'm going to write out some codes so this is my notepad right so the first thing i need to do i need to write the iframe code down so i just put iframe iframe sre so iframe s r c equals to width the width is let's make it 100 percent and the height the height should be let's make it 500 500 is preferable 500 double code i square my bracket right so this this src is the url right so i need to get a url so the next thing i'm going to do now i'm going to open my power bi app now as i go to powerbi.com okay so from powerbi.com, I'm going to go to workspace. I'll go to Nigerian census because that's actually the, what the, the, the report is all about. I'll go to my reports. After loading, I'll go to file. I'll go to embed reports. I'll get website or portal. So now you can see here is a link you can use to embed your content. So I'm going to copy this. I'll copy it, right? I'm going to paste it inside here. So you can see what I did. I paste it in the place I put that double quote. I've pasted it inside there, right? So I'm going to select all of this now. Select all. Copy. So the place I'm, I wrote the edit. This place, I'm going to go it inside of this. You can see what I did. I just pasted it here, right? And I, I pasted it. That was all. I just click on update. So it's going to update it for me now. So just give it a second. Second is going to update. So it has updated, right? So let me just view the post now. Okay. Now it's loading. So let's scroll down. Let me scroll down scroll down and you can see voila voila so you can see so beautiful you can see now i've embedded the power bi hub inside my wordpress so i can click on this it's going to be filtering real time so let me click on abia abia adamawa you can see now it's working real time now so now let me do the same thing now for youtube link now so i'll go to another post okay so this is another post i have here on creating data entry form in excel without using vba code so if you go to the heading part the last part of the blog post you'll notice that i have a youtube link over here you can see so the idea was that when, when you finish watching the video i also created a youtube link that you can also click here and it takes you to the youtube the link so let me just open it here so what i'm talking about so you're going to take it to a youtube channel which is over here you can see the YouTube channel, which is over here, right? So let me not show you what you're going to do. If I want to embed this YouTube channel now inside, let me just copy the URL. I want to embed it now inside my WordPress. So the other thing to do now is just go down a little bit. I just say, let me just delete all of this. We need all of this. I want to say square bracket embed square bracket. 
that I paste the URL. So I won't paste the URL here. And I write, I write another square bracket forward slash embed. Embed square bracket. And that's all. So what I need to do now is just click on update. So it's going to update for me. So let me just click on preview now. So let me just view my post now. So let's scroll down. Let's check it out if it's worked. So scrolling, I'm scrolling. And voila, you can see. Now I have my YouTube video inside my WordPress. So I've embedded my YouTube inside of my WordPress. So wow, 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 wow. So now you can see I've embedded my YouTube video inside my WordPress. I hope you guys learned a lot. This video was brought to you by your busage. Have fun, guys. Bye.